Yes. Oh, yes. I want to munch squad. I want to munch squad. Hello, everybody. Welcome to Munch Squad. That was a pregnant pause, Juicer. Oh, Justin. It hurt you really so long. It really left an uncomfortable place for us. Uh, welcome to Munch Squad. It's a podcast within a podcast, uh, profiling the latest and greatest in brand eating. So happy to have you back here on our show. Uh, I th- I was so excited when I heard about this story uh, about Wingstop. You guys have a Wingstop in your area? Yeah. Yeah, so it's like a wing joint. And I was so excited because they had Secret Invasion themed flavors awesome the, yeah right because apparently that mar disney's not even telling people when they do new shows a anymore secret. i think they're keeping it a secret yeah and this this one really is a secret because i had no idea until this actually brought me the awareness of this event and wingstop had two flavors and then the press release for it is like nothing i mean it's a nothing burger it's so disappointing so I started to look around, hoping there would be more details. And I found a story about the new Wingstop Secret Invasion thing on The Sun. And the Wait, story was where? about the sun, the U.S. Sun, not the sun. Oh. The sun. The American the US, sun that shines yes, exclusively American. on our incredible nation. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no. Um, so this is so they did a story about this too. And I thought their story was notable enough that I wanted to bring it for your consideration. This is fun. We've never done secondhand. This is like when they used to read the newspaper on TV news. Uh this yeah. is great. Buffalo Wild Wings rival adds two new items as part of secret invasion menu. <gasps> Fuck! Wow. Whoa, Whoa shots Sorry. called. What did you say? That's intense. Fire the That's across intense the bow. Shade, right? A popular chicken chain and Buffalo Wild Wings rival. This is the story. (laughs) A popular chicken chain and Buffalo Wild Wings rival has added two flavors to the menu. The restaurant is celebrating. They still have not identified this. This is bonkers. Did Buffalo Wild Wings pay for this story to run? I don't like it. Y'all, I don't know. Um, The restaurant is celebrating the launch of Marvel uh, series Secret Invasion. Wingstop has launched two new flavors for customers to add to their chicken wings or chicken sandwiches. Neither one of them as good as Buffalo Wild Wings flavors. Yeah, (laughs) they pale in comparison. Wingstop has launched two new flavors for customers to add to their chicken wings or chicken sandwiches. Customers can now choose from the following options when ordering via the Wingstop app or at wingstop.com only. Secretly sweet which is a mango habanero and tangy citrus balanced with rich Asian flavors. Don't mind if and I do. And flavor invasion. Savory garlic tossed with bold Cajun seasoning and buttery Parmesan. That Don't mind great. if I also yeah. do. Thank uh, you very much. Great. I'll take both. Thank you. Six both of both. flavors have a maximum spice rating of three flames out of three. Okay. But Wait. Here's the thing. Yeah. that's That seems quite spicy. Well, it's the maximum, Griffin. So it's the hottest thing that there could possibly be. The options are part of the store secret menu and only customers who are logged in will be able to see the flavors. So if you're just browsing, forget about it. You can't get them. But I wait, but I can't get them at the store, right? No, they're a secret. They're a secret. If you ask the employees, they'll call the cops. They'll say, shut the fuck up. What are you doing? Nick, Nick Fury, get out here. We got someone else for you to kill. Including these new additions, Wingstop customers can choose from a total of 14 flavors. Or, and it says this in the story, including these new two, adi- two new additions, Wingstop customers can choose from a total of 14 flavors or get their chicken plain. Huh. Sure, yeah. It's I nice mean, to can. know that the option is there because sometimes I worry that I'm going to ask for it plain and they're going to be like, we actually legally can't, can't do that. Yeah. Can't do that. So You'll th- have to hurry as secretly sweet and flavor invasion will only be available through July 9th. So we could start our own sort of chicken chain called Thigh Town. And in mm-hmm. Thigh Town, it's all about the bird. That's the that's the motto. Oh, that's we celebrate good. You, you come on into Thigh Town where it's all about the bird. Do we have sauces? Yes. They're all yeah. secret. And we're we're gonna look at you like, ooh, you wanna sauce up our bird? It's pretty good without. Are you sure about that? We are Thigh Town. We specialize in the bird. Okay, I guess so. It's your it's your mouth. 
It's your mouth is also a really it's great tagline. It's your mouth is a good Thigh one. Thigh town. It's your mouth. It's your mouth. That's and cool because it references two different body parts. And so people are like, what? What? We couldn't what call it stop? Mouth Town. That's already mm. taken by the music shop across the street. Mouth Town. It's your thigh. <laughs> the, the story continues. Wingstop Chain is one of several rivals to Buffalo Wild Wings, which <laughs> itself- Hey, listen, somebody's got to run a story about this. Uh, hey, Derek, <laughs> your dad owns a Buffalo Wild Wings, right? You write about this. Uh, which itself just launched two new flavors this month. Since June 1st, Buffalo Wild Wings customers have been able to choose from General <laughs> Tso's <laughs> and sweet chili lime sauces. These Our sauces limited- kick ass. <laughs> Our new limited edition sauces embody the perfect fusion of sweet, spicy, and savory that's perfect to enjoy throughout the summer, said Tristan Maline, the chief marketing officer at Buffalo Wild Wings, and my dad. No, <laughs> <laughs> However, it is unclear how long these flavors will stay on the menu. Okay. Wingstop isn't the only fast food joint to add some Marvel-themed menu items in recent weeks. Yeah, clearly. Burger King King also got into a Marvel mood with the launch of its new Spider-Man Whopper in May. Did you guys have one of those, by the way? No. I haven't. No, okay. Me neither. Uh, uh, Because I don't even know where a Burger King is. I don't know the last time I saw one. Released to celebrate the new Spider-Man movie, uh, Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse, the sandwich controversially features a red bun. Yes. We We've did talk talked about, about this. this. We've talked about this. Right. Despite some critics online saying they would never try it, the burger has been so popular that it has been selling out in many stores. Well, Meanwhile, McDonald's is making some key improvements to its signature. Fu- Can you imagine being the PR guy for, for Wingstop? And they're, they're talking about a fucking another place? How many <laughs> rest is our story? I'm sorry we only wrote a two paragraph press release that didn't even say something like, get ready for a mission, a flavor, get ready for a flavor mission agent because <laughs> you're going <laughs> to something, man. We this tried to do a normal squad. one. You're and- not going to get the call up to the big show if you don't have a quote from Samuel Jackson yeah. talking about these motherfucking wings are so motherfucking deli- something. Yeah. You know, like you got a curse. My motherfucking curse. head feels like a motherfucking cantaloupe. I'm going to fucking die over it. <laughs> Please fucking help me. Why are you, you laughing? Be- I could tell you how old I am and you would not believe it. God, right. I love these wings. God, these wings are good. You guys want another question? Or? Yeah, I'd love another question. 70. Wow. 74. No, I told you. Incredible. I told you. No matter how old Samuel L. Jackson is, it, that number will never stop. Uh, will never stop amazing me. Um, it was amazing. Uh, okay. Here is our next question. 